Okay, let's go for it. Control Dell. The Douglas DC3. Let us go for it. Takes off with about 60 something. Uh, here we will not spend much time. I mean, uh, what to say, it is fun and practice. Uh, have in mind that engines go until uh, 3000 RPM. Okay, airborne. Good. We are airborne. Uh, very nice sounds, very nice sounds. Anytime you can stall, anytime you can fall. Okay, 3000 RPM. We are airborne. Of course, we are going to land. What? Very good practice, though. You can practice very well. So we go to land, it is that simple. Let us try to land. I even downloaded the delivery. Like this, I mean, it is a little bit ridiculous, isn't it? I mean, this is like a children's toy, isn't it? But the systems inside are, what to say, quite detailed. Have a look at your vertical speed, isn't it? And at your airspeed, at your altitude, those three things. Altitude. I don't even know the elevation of the airport. Which airport is it important? It has uh, anyhow. The runway is just fine. It's a long runway. We are turning to land. Maybe it will be something very terrible. I don't know. At any moment, it can stall. All bad things can happen. I suppose what to say. I will not spend my life with a DC3. Here it is. Okay. I'm sure we will be off. seems to be quite a lot. Other approaches were much more worse. Okay. Throttle to idle. Managed. Slowly, 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 vertical speed, uh, 50. Okay. Okay. Now, now the plane will somehow, I don't, I, I keep adding speed. Okay. We landed somehow, isn't it? Okay, we will not spend uh, much time with this plane, of course. Uh, I saved uh, some camera views. The cameras are just nice, yes. The cameras are nice. We just wanted to have a challenge and to land this plane. This historical plane. Okay, we saved even an external drone camera. And also the sounds of the plane are excellent. With every detail. Yes, not bad, not bad. Not bad for those who are interested, I mean I'm not. Okay, I mean, I mean I'm not interested. There are a few flaws that help to save some wonderful 
views, even from outside. So I have here, for instance, uh, this camera somehow was uh, necessary in order to see a little bit, because with the default camera you don't see nothing, so three other cameras from inside the plane. This is also very nice. And from the left side, you have access inside the plane, isn't it? Somehow this is quite an exception. Who is interested? Who is interested really about uh, this entry with Douglas? I'm not. Okay, this is of course the perspectives are just wonderful. I mean, they are just fine. But it is uh, prehistorical. This thing. I mean, is, is there any reason to spend your time to fly the DC3 instead of flying the 787? I'm just wondering. And I think we never flew any other propeller plane, isn't it? Here it is. Very difficult to land on this plane. Very difficult. So ladies and gentlemen, this is all for now. I think we may spend uh, quite some time with the uh, DC-3. It was just a challenge to land this plane and to have a look also at the cameras. Thank you for watching this clip and I hope to see you soon to the next one. Bye for now.